Hey everyone, my name is Wesley and welcome back to Cyberpunk 2077. Oh, good start to this episode too. Last week we had hooting cars, now we've got flipping a brain meltdown. Um, yeah, <laughs> welcome back. Last week we lost Takamura, apparently. I don't know if he is dead though, but it did seem like it. We need to meet with, oh this is so annoying. We need to meet with Hanaka, Hanako whatever her name is. But yeah, if you enjoyed this episode, I'd really appreciate it if you could leave a like, comment and subscribe. Let's get on with it. Johnny, can you fix my brain, please? What's up? <clears throat> you got a few more words about the porcelain cunt? Can't say that word on YouTube. Oh, jeez. Get ready. Four? Oh, baddies. Fuck. Lots of baddies. Cheers, mate. You ain't dying yet. I, I don't know. It feels kind of feels like I am. Yay, drugs! I mean, don't don't do drugs, kids. That smells the sea breeze. How'd you get us here? Get up. And why are half the pills on the floor? Damn. Was flatlined by that attack. <laughs> Almost. I know where we are, V. We bought that roller coaster that I went on during a live stream. <laughs> I know where we are. That's why I didn't choose that option. Pacifica? What's this building? Old hotel, the Pista Sophia. What building? Oh, the one we're <laughs> right. Not bad. Come on. Uh, that one. Saw the pseudo endo trizine in your hand. Pseudo endo what? what? Sounds like a flipping Pokemon move. Got this strange impression your comatose self wanted to get rid of me. Actually, put up a good fight. Oh, no. Not that good a fight, apparently. Being a bit pathetic here, V. Not gonna lie. Wait, I need to get rid of something. How do I dismantle again? Okay, whatever. Oh my word! I think I woke up. Derailed your plan in the nick of time. Mm-hmm. I think fear of death's got you spewing misdirected anger. I'm definitely like over encumbered. Okay, not over encumbered anymore. Now I can walk. Thank you. Can manage that. Okay. I don't know. I've fallen three times on the walk here already. Uh, nailed it. You wanted to know Stuck the landing. Don't know what's going on with my <laughs> HUD on the bottom left there. Hardy hole. Hardy hole. Is this where you kept your midnight snacks? I don't want them. What are they? No. Hell no. Um. Let's go. Dumb question. Dumbass question. Yes or no? No. No. I wouldn't. Tags belong to a man who sacrificed his life for mine in Mexico. Seems like an idiot. Thinking about our predicament. Want to be clear? I will do you no wrong. You've done a lot of wrong. It'll be my life for yours. I'll agree to get white. Oh. Thanks are proof of my promise. 
Oh, crap. Sorry, I uh, misread that situation. Kind gesture, I guess. But you can't really give me something I already have. Body's mine. Always has been. It's my decision. Not Let's not truth. talk on it anymore for now. Okay. <laughs> Seriously considering Hanako's offer? Yep. I'll do what I need to survive. Even if I have to get my hands <coughs> dirty. <coughs> Listen, you'll do what you think's right. You're in charge here. Just got one request. Well, Adam Smasher. Fucker who got the better of me. Mm -hmm. Whatever happens to me, I want him serious. Sure, no problem, bear. Right. Understood. Got absolutely no problem with that. Uh, well, that might be a bit harder to arrange. And it's just as important for her. Okay, I'll do my best. from Misty, and I'll steer the ship for a bit. I'm not at all excited about this plan. Realize that, right? Just gonna have a quick chat with Rogue about Smasher. Then I'm out. I promise. Uh, Tama, don't believe that, but what's the worst that could happen? I'll tell Rogue the truth. See if Holy smokes, my computer is about to lift off here. Gotta do is mention Smasher. Serve him up on a platter. Muse over the old day. Easy. Fine. I'll do this for you. Appreciate it. Thanks. Take me to the afterlife. Promise you won't regret this. Okay. Feeling better. Should get going. Still feel a sharp something. Time for a party. Now that's ever going on. Leave the hotel through. Why did we have to come in here? Oh, right, to get that stuff. Never mind. Uh, I'd love to get. Yeah. The hotel pissed to Sophia. Is that right? Mm -hmm. uh, nice to die. Just not today. Okay. Work that time. Alrighty. Amber's hotel. Going with her to oh sorry point of no return. You reach a point of no return when you enter the restaurant. You will be locked out of all unfinished side jobs. Eh? Well, crap. Um. Okay, who cares? Let's do this. Don't know what that means. Street embers, embers, gotta be embers, hey. Oh, yeah, yeah another relic malfunction. I feel sick. Don't like this at all. Oh, yeah, yeah, I do. Bitch is the worst kind of news. Can you chill for two seconds? Yeah, come on, Johnny. Go in and talk. I'm handling this brain malfunctioning thing a lot better than you. Hello, nice suit. Hello, nice suit. She emptied the place. Shit. Uh, excuse me, sorry to bother you, but. You have come. Ah, thank you. Nice dress. Let's step to it then. <laughs> Jack Johnny. I feel I owe you an explanation. I must tell you why I changed my mind. And wish to help. I'm not sure of anything. If you could trust me, if your Nobu killed your father, now. I knew. From the start. You knew? All the board members knew. Hmm. Not one soul, even slightly interested in the matter, believed in the poisoning. <laughs> Details were disparate, inconsistent. 
Helped your brother cover up. Makes you no better than him. Not a snake. Yeah. I do not know my family. Holy smack, she has crazy fingers. My father had flaws. Father. I know this. I Sound like gold member. About it. When a foe needed removal, my father ordered it <laughs> without a thought to mercy. A way of being Yorinobu could not abide. But to my father, ends ever justified means. Okay. Saburo Arasaka has always valued just one thing. Do you know what it is? Um. Power, probably. Family. Ah. Well, that served them well. I was to be its heart, to uphold life, ensure continuity, stability, never to oppose it. Huh. Guess your Nobu's instructions were a little different. <laughs> Yorinobu raised his hand against our father, but he is an Arasaka. He is family. I do not expect you to understand. I wish you merely to know I do not oppose my brother willingly. That it is difficult. Okay. Mm -hmm. So why are you gonna help us now then? Let's say I get that. What changed your mind? We received a warning during the parade. Security protocols were violated. The first doubts sprouted then. They grew yet greater in your hideout when my brother's assault group arrived not to rescue, oh, geez. but to kill. I know who was just plain willing to sacrifice you. Well, that's a bit intense. Right about my brother. He never cared for us. I was brought up to be the heart of the family. It is time for the Arasakas to listen to their heart. It will bring justice. Did you bring Soul Killer? As we agreed, you would. I think so. me for a fool think I'd fall for that got plans to walk out of here alive had I any ill intentions I would have chosen a side far more discreet than this well I mean your brother chose the black main room in his dad's hotel to kill him so. Mikoshi don't exist in real space yet its access points do sorry about all the story in this episode guys can I sit? Can I, can I, can I please sit? One of these? We ought to leave. Right now. Want to leave? What gave you that idea? Quit button in so I can hear her out. Yeah, Johnny, just freaking pour me another drink, man. We have little time. Yeah, now I can sit. You'll help me in exchange my brother you catch a whiff of that smells like shit careful not to step in it the drink or what she's speaking let's have a drink might help the brain meltdowns well that is a big sip johnny i mean v just say it be easier that way yeah get it out Punished. You want him dead. I want the Arasaka Corporation to know the truth. How are you okay. trying to do this? Excuse me. Excuse me. We're having a conversation here. Yes. It's always freaking raining here at night. All factions are expected to attend. The perfect moment for them to learn the circumstances of my father's death i will get you into this meeting and she's gonna die before it happens my brother watch what i tell you listen mind if i'm straight with you help me get rid of yorinobu i will help you get rid of the construct offer is intriguing need to think about it naturally and 
Well, brain, my, my brain's dying. Sorry, ma'am. Just uh, hold on one second. I can't. My brain's bloody dying. No, no. Not at all. Ma'am? Yep. Don't delay. Make your no decisions. Worries. About that. Everything's red. You could use some air right now. Okay, I'm going I'm going to the air. No, I didn't make it to the air. This is the opposite of air. Holy moly. Oh, it was a restaurant, not a hotel. Johnny, you ass. Doing? I'm showing you what it's like to feel fucking trapped. Now you're an ass again. I don't get this guy. But you've insisted on not giving a shit. Now this porcelain cunt's gonna use you in her fancy scheme. Fuck off. I haven't agreed to anything. But I know you still don't understand how these leeches operate. Whatever. She met you face to face. She revealed her plan. She sunk her teeth deep into you. Not gonna be able to pry yourself out. I can do whatever I want, except for you know, get to the bottom of this left. Got any other ideas? I'd love to hear He told us his idea. Meet with Rogue and kill Adam Smasher and do some stuff. No, we're not, V. So that was just an explosion in my head. Whew. Okay, so... Some really bad brain problems this episode. <clears throat> Victor! My boy! Sensitivity is a good sign. Means your optic nerves aren't damaged. How... How'd I get here? Drag yourself here. Beat the hell and back. Jeez. You missed the hell of a fright. Then you shoved my patient at the time off the <laughs> Good. And demanded you be treated immediately. Tell him it was your guardian angel. Huh? I, uh... Wasn't completely myself. Yeah, it's this freaking brain virus. And that's a bit worrying. Just give it to me straight, Vic. You've come to a critical juncture. Try sitting up carefully. Okay. Hey, don't expect a miracle. Slow heavy. Sick bit. Uh, another victory for the history books. <laughs> Misty! Screw you, dude. I hated you, I loved you, I hated you. Suck. If you got something to say, Vic, just say it. What? I'm meant to look at that. I don't know, I'm trying to get it out of me. Looking at you, not long at all. Next attack, you will be able to crawl back here. You'll flatline in some back alley. Well, what do I do about it? This is your last chance to take matters into your own hands. Understand? Yeah, I know. Thoughts on where to start? Jesus, again. Do I have to spell it out? It's in your hands. Not mine, and not those of that thing in your head. <laughs> yeah, he's gone. He's gonna call him a thing. Set up over there. You're a thing. Uh huh. You'll find something there that'll help you end this on your own terms. If you can manage to cross those few yards, the rest will be up to you and you alone. 
Oh crap. Wait, what? My decision. What the hell is going on? Need to stretch your noodle? Fine. Just not, it's not in this basement. Christ, you're talking up. <laughs> Can you end there on that cliffhanger? Enjoy that one, everyone. Catch you all in the next video. Goodbye. <laughs>